everybody, how are you today? My name is Melissa and I am from thefarmgirlgabs.com. Thank you so much for joining me. I am here in a wet and rainy Boston today. Um, I, um, I came to bring Gabrielle back to college, sadly. Sniff, sniff. She's ready to get rid of me, but um, we had all the intentions of exploring Boston today. Um, which we did do a little bit, but it's um, a little rainy and cold. So I just wanted to hop on real quick and show you a really cool community garden. Um, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. There's a glitch in the Facebook, so I can't see if anybody's asking me any questions. So I promise I'm not ignoring you. I will go back and answer them later. Let me take this off. Not very becoming today, is it? Woo! Okay. The rain stopped a little bit. Anyway, I am um, I'm in the Back Bay Fence, which is um, part of the Emerald Necklace in Boston. Um, if you, I put a link in the description. I did a post uh, probably a couple months ago about fun things to do in Boston, and we just happened upon this really cool community garden. So I'm gonna flip it around. Miss Gabby. <laughs> Say hi, Gabrielle. Hi. <laughs> See, she's ready to get rid of me. Um, she moves into her dorm tomorrow for her second year of college. Uh, she goes to Emanuel College. But anyway, we are in a community garden. Um, this is um, the Back Bay Fens, um, which is very close to her campus. It sits along the Muddy River. And um, I just wanted to show you how cool this is. Now, I obviously, we live on a very large farm, so um, I think community gardens are so cool because if you live in the city, obviously you don't have a lot of space, but there's options if you like to garden or if you like to plant flowers. Um, you know, it's not something that I'm used to because obviously, like I said, the town that we live in has a, um, usually the plots of land are at least an acre or more. But if you don't have any, um, you know, a lot of yard, you could you could do a community garden, and it's a really nice thing that a lot of cities offer. And um, I, I really imp am impressed by um, these little plots and how well everybody's really taking care of them. Um, so I just wanted to hop on real quick. I'm gonna try and hop on later. I'm not sure we were gonna ha we had a lot of plans that we were gonna do today, but like I said, it's a little cold and rainy. Let me flip this. It's a little cold and rainy and Gabrielle, here she is, look at her. She's about had it with me. <laughs> anyway, um, I just wanted to hop on real quick and show you all this really cool community garden. Um, if you have any questions, like I said, leave them in the comments below. Be sure to follow me on um, social media. I'm the Farm Girl Gabs on Instagram, on Facebook obviously, and Twitter. Um, be sure to read the link to post um, in the description, 15 fun things to do in Boston. Um, it's a great city. I love visiting this town. Um, Gabby's fell in love with it last year when she started her freshman year in college. And I think that's it. Right, Gabs? Yeah. Got anything to say? She's my quiet kid. <laughs> AJ doesn't stop talking and Gabby, you gotta pull things out of her. Anyway, we love her anyway. All right, so that's it. We will see you soon. We're going to go dry off a little bit at our hotel. I'll talk to you later. Thanks a lot for following. Bye-bye.